Hey guys, welcome back. It's the Cardist, and today I'm going to be reviewing the Bicycle uh, 128 Years Edition. Now, today you can see there's a big change I have been talking about on Facebook. Now, this is a studio that I'm actually in at Davenport. You can go um, locate them in Charing Cross. You need to go check them out, a great little company, uh, and you can find them on the underground and they've got some nice decks. So, pick this deck up also from Davenport, so the link is in the description below. So let's get straight on with the box. Now this deck is to symbolise and to talk about basically because the bicycle have been going for 128 years now and this is kind of their thank you, like there's a 125 year deck, now this is the 128 year deck. So as you can see on the front it has a gold foil and it has bicycle on the top here. It has a ace of spades uh, with like a crown in the centre. It says ma majestic there as well, in my, my way of speaking, <laughs> my bad. It says majestic there as well and it has majestic playing cards. So I'm not sure if this deck's called the Majestic Playing Cards or 125 Years, so if you guys want to comment what exact name of this deck is, you can comment down below. On the bottom it has the standard copyright information, uh, the Elite Playing Cards, oh sorry, these are the Elite Playing Cards, mistake my bad. Um, on the side it has obviously the bicycle with the Gold 4, and the Gold 4 is a hole around the deck, so you've never seen a deck uh, with Gold 4 around the whole deck, you usually just see it on the front. And it says the United States Playing Card Company just there also. On the top it has air cushion finish, I'm guessing this is standard stock but we'll have to wait and see till we get inside. It comes with a gold uh, seal as well so that's always good because it fits with the uh, deck as well because it'd be weird if they had a different colour so that's good from them. So we have this gold kind of border, we have two borders going around it and we have like these lions and a crown in the middle and we have this line going through here so it's a really nice looking back design but let's get into it and see what we get. Let's just pop this open. As you can see, we get like, this artwork that says Elite on here, and it has some copyright information there also. On the tabs, there's nothing much, it's just plain black, but then deck inside the box goes white as well. So here you go, as you can see, it's just plain inside. Okay, so let's get straight on into this. Now, on what you receive the deck, let me just get them out for you guys, is you receive two Jokers. You receive this one here, it says Joker, it has, um, Joke on the top here and here, and it's I'm trying to work this out myself. No, it's not. I thought it may be mirrored or something, but it's just one Joker. He's on his knees, and he's got a um, one of them hats the Jokers wear, and he's got his hands out. I'm not sure if he's trying to do a joke or something, but I'm not too sure. And it kind of looks like a stamp or like a beer, top of a beer thing. So there you go. There's the first Joker. There's no reveal in it, as I can see. If it's a, if there is, I will someone will spot this out. The next one says Joker, and it's like a, a black guy in a suit and he's got a red smile on him, it says Joker, Joker, and it says inspired by, uh, what's I say, Bobby uh, Fortin, um, if that's pronounced right, if not, then I do apologize. Then we receive a double backer, and as you can see, the back is different to the box. We have a black one there, but it's a white outside, and it has a gold um, a line going around the outside. The same with the lions, or the horses, I'm not too sure, they were lions, or they're horses, my bad. Um, we have received horses here in the crown and we have like this crest here as here as well. It's a really nice uh, double backer as well because you can use that for certain tricks. Then it has elite playing cards and it has like the kind of logo to, and an E in the middle and a gold thing going around too and you have the back design there. So let's move on to what you receive in the card. So I'll go over these spades first and then we can go over the rest. So first off you get a custom ace of spades, uh, have this nice this ace of spades premium and this is United States Playing Card Company. You have this artwork design here and here and a crown going on as also. So you get a nice little custom ace, I'm not sure if there's four custom aces but we will see. Now I've noticed with all these cards they have like this kind of line going through them to kind of step, make them stand out a little bit more, it's kind of a like gold line so it's still sticking with the gold theme of the deck so that's cool as well. So we'll go through and I'll quickly give you a bit of a show, okay, as you can see it sticks with the whole theme the whole way through the deck. Then you get to the royalty, they, they go the whole way through. Okay, and then the royalty, you can see these are standard United States playing card seal royalty, but they have gold and they have the grey, and it's just really nice colours, and they still stick with the line there as well to so the gold. So it's very sticking with the deck itself. So let's move on to the diamonds. So this has just been opened, and it usually goes jacks, uh, the spades, hearts, but they've gone diamonds this time, so this is unique. I don't know if it's a special order. We have the diamonds, you can see it has a line in it as well. There's not four custom aces, I was mistaken. And you can see these still have the lines also, so that's great. We get to the royalty, exactly the same. It says Jack, uh, Queen King, same colours as the ones there, but just with a red also. So we'll move on to now the clubs. 
So the clubs are different, they're a little bit unique, um, they're the same colours as the spades and they do look good because of the grey and the gold so it still sticks with the dark themes of the deck. The same goes the whole way through and you can see that it's the whole one here. But then the club actually has a bigger pip but I noticed in the diamonds it didn't. you didn't receive a bigger pip. Oh yes you did, my bad. So you do have four custom aces um, that is bigger here. So you get bigger pips than usual but then the club is bigger. So you get four custom aces but they're kind of just, they just enlarged them a little bit. The hearts are exactly the same as the diamonds, but they have this kind of scroll work, scroll work going on in with the hearts, and you can see here it carries on going through. And then there you go, see so with the custom aces. Now let's see how this deck handles. Now for all you magicians out there, you want to know how it handles. So we're going to give it a fan. As you can see, it looks really good when you fan it. And as I see, I'm a left-handed, so we're going to have to do it at a certain angle because, as you can see, when you do left-handed, it does look good in left-handed. But obviously, they need to make a left-handed version of deck soon, maybe one day. It does dribble well. It's springs well also and it flips great as well and it looks good when you do it as well now let's do a giant fan because a lot of you have requested for me to do a giant fan and as I said I'm not very good but we're just gonna have to wait and see see if it goes well cross our fingers oh god here we go I can see me dropping the deck here so we'll just give it a shot here and it looks good in a giant fan but obviously I'm not so good so there'll be better people to do this with so yes, you can pick this deck up from Davenport's. Now I would give this deck a 8 out of 10 because I like the gold on it and it looks really good. But first off, you can go check out Davenport's because they have supplied a bicycle rider back playing cards blue. This contest will end near the end of the month, so there's not an exact date, but you can win this pack of cards. All you've got to do is go to Davenport's Facebook page, that'll be in the description, like their page, subscribe to their new YouTube channel and subscribe to mine and like the video. And then you can comment saying done if you don't, you don't have to, but then we will choose a winner and we'll announce that sooner at the end of the month, maybe into next month. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.